Hello again kids, how are you doing? Ready for today's lesson? Possibilities in the future. Oh, okay, what's a possibility? Something that can happen, okay? Something that I possibly can do tomorrow, the day after tomorrow, next week, next month, next year, I don't know, in the future. So, we're going to talk about three different words. Could, might, and will. Now, could and might, both of them show me a possibility. Okay? Not for sure. No es de seguro. It's just a possibility. And will? Okay, will. Will is going to happen. It's a decision. For example, tomorrow, yo no trabajar. Okay, that's a decision. Tomorrow is Sunday for me. This video is going to be shown on Friday, so tomorrow is Saturday. Back at it. Never mind. But, will is something that, for real, in the future is going to happen. Now, let me make some examples with each one of these in order to you to understand. I could win the race. I could podría win the race if I train hard. Okay? That's a possibility for me to win the race if I train very hard. Let's make another example. Um, you know what? Um, my mother My mother could take me home later. She could do it. Okay, but that's a possibility. Maybe she will have to work. So it's a possibility. And um we're going to use Mike as well. As the same way we do the other. For example, uh, let me see. Okay, um Talking about you and me, you kids and us, teachers and students, we might we might see each other next month. I'm going to say it in Spanish. I hate to do this, but I want you to have this here. Puede que nos veamos el otro mes. We might see each other next month. Okay, kids? Now, let's go with the last one. Let's go with will. For something that is going to happen in the future, you always use will. Plus the verb in the base form. Okay? Verb in the base form. Run, jump. Not jumping, not running or sleeping, no. Sleep, run, jump, eat, walk. Okay, kids? Now, for example, mm, it's um, 1040 right now. I am hungry, so I will eat.
later. This is not a possibility. This is for sure. I will eat later. Okay? And, um, okay, um, what? I will will watch the bird TV with my family. Right kids? This is a very easy lesson. This is our new unit. Okay? So, I really want you to pay attention. Watch the video once, watch it twice, or even three times if it's necessary. There are short videos for you to not get bored. But I need you to understand this lesson. This is our new unit. So please kids, 